Good afternoon, my name is Solomon Emmanuel Enokela. I work with Mercy Corp Nigeria as um, Senior Program Officer, Social Cohesion. This is Tilas, a primary school located in our local government. This primary school housed 450 pupils. Before the intervention of EU MEDA, EU MEDA is European Union, then MEDA is the program being funded by European Union. Before this intervention, this is the primary school where 450 pupils were housed. Now, this is Tila's primary school. From inside, you can see the blackboard and where they use for learning. This is another classroom where they use for learning. That is before the program intervention of EU MAIDA. Now, I'm going to call the local government chairman who is right here with me to say a word or two before we take a look at the completed project by MAIDA team in social cohesion. Chairman, sir. Sir, can you tell us your name and how do you feel about this project that is going on in your local government? My name is Bubo Andelia Iringo, the vice chairman of our local government area, representing the chairman council, Al Haji Ibrahim Hassan. I am very, very <coughs> sympathetic with this area about the primary school, as you can see how it is. The government nowadays have no means or uh, is poor to build up all the primary schools in the local government. We are in short of houses, we are in short of classrooms, we are in short of means of tax, that is income. So the government is not able to do all the works. But we are grateful to Mexico since they have come in and assisted. And we are sure and promise that we will supplement the effort of the Mexico transfer. May the Lord be with us and help us. Amen. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much. We are going to call the Education Secretary, who is also represented here. Education Secretary, sir. My, Tell us your name and what you feel about our project here. My name is Mohamed Ali, representing the Education Secretary of Local Government Education Authority. Uh, I'm very grateful for this project that has took place here. In fact, everybody in education are very, very happy about the project that took place here. You know, we have not enough money to build such a classroom. We have no single word to thank the Mexico officials. We are very grateful. May Allah uplift them to the sky up to the limit. If you can see this, uh, the former uh, school, which was built with mud. So, in fact, they came in with the intervention of four classroom buildings with VIP toilets, plus two. So, we are most grateful. We will make sure that the community effort will come down to maintain the school so that learning will take place very easily. We are not going to put our hands down. We will make sure that the effort of the committee, the local government education authority, plus the pupils and the teachers, make sure that we will maintain the school so that they will, it will not be destroyed by either animals or any harmful materials. Thank you very much. Thank you, Education Secretary. You, you have heard from them. The next thing is that MEDA sponsored or being funded by EU is still bringing a transformer, a 300 transformer KVA here to the community. But meanwhile, let's take a look at the completed building. Just a short video clip. Come with me, sir. Completed primary school from the side view. Complete. This is the two block 
of four classrooms being constructed, built by EU, European Union, and through Mercy Corp Nigeria. Um, this end the video for us. I hope you join us next time when we go to the next community for community asset hand handing over. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you.